everybody. How are you guys doing? I have been up bright and early today. Uh, Walking Mucky, uh, he's been kind of not, has a little anxiety going on. Wasn't feeling well, but this morning he feels good. So I um, took him to school, fed him, give him some more love and kisses and hugs. So uh, he's on the mend, so that makes me very happy. But um, today I already went to Trader Joe's. Uh, I was going to do a cooking video right now, now but I'm like, I'm going to show you what I got at Trader Joe's. Plus, you guys, it, it's, I need a little drink. I need a little. It's either that or uh, a snack. So I'm just going to have a little of my little Baileys that I got. It's so cute. And this is the alcoholic one. Because most of the time I show you the one that isn't. In fact, I was only going to have half of this coffee with my Baileys. Okay, I'll be a good girl. But we will add it all. Because I love the smell of ba Baileys. It's probably my favorite smell of a liqueur. Sambuca, though I love that too. And I gotta go to bed more to get that. But anyway, cheers to start out our um, Trader Joe's haul. Mini haul. Very mini. Also, um, what I'm uh, watch the recipe coming up soon. I needed a uh, heavy cream. And I'm like, yeah, and you guys know if, you, if you've been uh, watching my videos, the only cream is at Trader Joe's. Real cream. You can get half and half at Bonds and everything else, but the real cream is at Trader Joe's. So, made a trek there. No cream. No cream in the shelf. I'm like, okay, and I'm at the point where I just ask if there's some in the back or whatever because I need it for my recipe. So, yeah, that didn't happen. He went and checked, though. So, that was very, very nice of him. Very, very, I don't know if there's advertising on that candle. Just, actually, uh, oh, that was like a blind date I had gone on. Uh, I should probably talk about that one, too. I could talk about some of my dates, you guys. Stay tuned. It, it will be coming up. So, let's see. To the beach yeah i'm going i'm gonna try and go to the beach today but i wanted to do some videos and oh okay i think i smashed my fresh basil but oh i am so growing to like mm, smelling fresh herbs so nothing like fresh basil <laughs> not making a nose a little watery but so yeah i need it i all this stuff I got I need for stuff I'm going to be cooking and I'm so hungry right now I was like oh so this is gonna cure my appetite but um, I did a couple of videos but um, there they were not flagged but they're like oh somebody's like you have to request a review because something in the title the words um, must have triggered something so I'm waiting on two videos they got they get the yellow caution triangles on your video and so I'm waiting on that one of them had uh, well I can't tell you but it had the word hot in it like hot food and that got mm, I'm like oh, seriously that is just so crazy and then the other one uh, that triggered it was uh, the word died that's all I'm gonna say but I have requested them to look at that and it's nothing bad but Anyway, basil, fresh basil. Gotta have it. Gotta have it. Oh. Probably wondering why this big wine's here. That is going. Because I'm cooking Italian in my video. How cool is that? And you guys got a sneak peek at what I am going to open. It is the Chianti. And I just get it for this. It's so cool. I love it. I was in an Italian restaurant once where they had all these hanging off of their ceiling. That was so cool. Maybe I'll do that too. I don't know. Did you guys see my my half of my gecko? I kind of brought them up here. Oh, this is my California Angels freezer bag. But let me show you. Now my, my gecko has been with me since I had been in California. When I first lived with um, Trisha and Callie and Sherman Oaks, there was a Target that had still outdoor furniture. And that was my pride and joy then, and it still is now, and I love him. And he follows me wherever I go, so that's cool. Okay. Onward we go. So. 
A lot of people just wear caps so they don't have to, like, do the top of their hair. I've noticed, I, you know, it's either that or they're balding or the sun's in their eyes. I don't, I, you know. But, I, I fooled you, I don't have either one. I hope I'm not balding, but I'm just going for a look. No particular look at all. So, um, actually, how cute are these little mini eggs? They're not my, you know, I get the usually the large, but since I was at Trader Joe's and I was just going to stop once, but didn't because they didn't have some things. And I had it out of my bonds, but I have, I got these anyway because I really only need six. Like I have like uh, eight out of a dozen that have, or have to throw away. I just, I don't eat eggs as much as I did, but these are so cute and they're brown. They're already Easter colored. Okay, they're not, I know, brown is not, I would like to say mocha is not colored Easter eggs, but I don't color them anymore, so there you go. Oh, little pillow kind of works, works for me, huh, babe? Okay, this is how it'll look after I've had five of these, which I won't. Just have a little. This is really good, though. Mm. This is, um, I don't know when you guys are going to see this, but I'm just starting my Easter weekend off. So I know it might have come and gone by then, Easter. I don't know. But if not, you know, this is how Good Friday is coming down for me. Okay, that's for my um, video. I, I needed some penne. I was going to use the other stuff, but I, it called for penne, and I'm like, it, you're going to guess it pretty soon, but yeah. Then I also needed some crushed tomatoes, and then I see plum tomatoes. I'm like, wait, and then it says crushed. There's so much writing sometimes on these, but uh, they do have great labeling, I got to say, at Trader Joe's. It's just like vintage labeling, <laughs> kind of like that. Um over there uh, and perhaps I should put my eggs over here too this is my other go-to stand Whoa. there we go okay um what else oh I had to have some mozzarella I thought I had some oh you know me I'm a cheese order but they had no mozzarella so I got the mozzarella the fresh cheese log um first of all oh what's on that but that's like fresh like they make like you see on diners dry, drive ins and dives in those pizza Italian places where they're making it with that hot boiled water and so that's cool but I also when I went to Vons had to get an extra one too but this is the coolest one from Trader Joe's so just in case I think it'll taste fine I'm sure it will and then my favorite I don't know I think I have talked about this French onion soup from Trader Joe's and I've always been I should just make my own I know but I I was re looking at a recipe it takes like two hours but most of it's simmering and I should and quit being so lazy but I like it for a little backup I always put a little extra extra cheese on the top but uh, there is a piece of I think there is a piece of bread in there too no, it doesn't. Oh, croutons. I should have got. Well, if I ever have any old sourdough crusty bread, I'll put it in there to soak it up. But that's that's really good for a store bought and French onion soup. Then I needed some yellow onions or white onions. And of course, I splurged and got the Hawaiian sweet onions for my dish. So excited. In fact, right after this, I probably will start cooking 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 and I am gonna open that bottle of Chianti it's been a long time since I had some wine and yeah that's it uh, if you see this it's um, not Trader Joe's they did not have this and I cannot believe it I'm gonna call you out Trader Joe's you didn't have the cream and you also didn't have dill pickle relish they had sweet pickle relish and I got that too but I needed the dill pickle and you will see that's a, a different video altogether so I had to go to Vons and get that, and yeah. But I had to go to the post office anyway, so they're all just kind of around the same area. I can't complain. Everything is so convenient 
where I live, you guys. I'm, I'm very, very spoiled, I have to say. Which is going to take me a lot to move somewhere else. But I would if it was to be close to my kids. I, I would. So, um, okay. That was my mini trip to... Trader Joe's, you know, and there wasn't traffic. I'm like, wait, it's Friday. There, oh, so much, always oh, so tons of traffic. I'm like, oh my gosh, everybody's off, I guess, for um, Good Friday. And um, I have to tell you this other story. I'm not a nosy neighbor at all, but I have these floor to ceiling windows, right? So, and I take Mookie, I have to take Mookie out four or five times a day, maybe more. But my, Mookie and I happen to just be going down the steps, and my neighbor, because there's like, I think four people live in separate parts of the house. And um, from my driveway to the neighbor's halfway to the driveway, which is, I don't know, 100 feet was so much food, snacks, alcohol, more snacks, more food. I'm like, and they were loading up this SUV, and there, might have, there must have been like eight people out there. I'm like, thinking, wow, okay, I get it, but... <laughs> And it was piled on the sidewalk. I'm like, well, they're going to party. And I thought, how? And then I first thought they were going to crawl in the vehicle, but they must have had separate cars. I don't, because I think they had that whole SUV loaded with all their stuff. And he was still trying to jam stuff in. And, you know, they had their lawn chairs. And, but it was mostly big bottles of alcohol and that. I'm like, ah, I'm going to join them. But I think probably where they were going is Coachella or Palm Springs. Everybody really heads out there. I need to go out there and see what's happening. Um, I went like in 80, 1984 one time, and I bought the coolest clothes out there. I don't know if they still do. I mean, we're talking decades ago. But I would go out and see, you know. I think it's the perfect weather, always hot. Everybody's always got a pool, so... But um, then somebody said they thought it was the Country Western. I don't know what they call it. Coachella. Oh, I, I don't know because I've never gone to it. But I would like that, the Country Western one. But I just, I cannot do those crowds, you guys. More power to you if you can. But this mama is staying home. Most I can do is go down to Irks and have a drink or rock and fish. Well, and do my walking and do my weights. But... Anyway, um, so yeah, that's my mini haul, but I do, do you guys ever like put stuff around the house that you need to order? Like I need to order this. So this is sitting here. I need to order this. Otherwise, if I don't write it down, see, I got to do my eyes alive. This purple shampoo though is the bomb. You guys, if you have blonde hair and it's starting to get yellowish or you want to brighten it up right there, a purple shampoo will boom, just make it more vibrant more vibrant and then also I wanted to order all these are from a separate side I just while it's quiet I need to order this but this was um this sneaky vaunt this is um I think Trisha promoted this but it was those strapless bras remember that give you no bra fat at all and I had a pink one at it it's gone I wonder if Callie took it but I'll order I'm gonna order two more because I love them so much I and, uh, you know, when I have to put on the regular bras, like, I usually do my sports bras, but got to do those three things for sure today. Uh, got to do my bedding. I got a lot to do, but you know what? I'm going to cook because I'm going to cook for you and I'm going to eat and I love to eat and that's a, it's funny, but nice. I was watching one of Trisha's videos because I love to eat. You know, that's my family. We love to eat, you know, and I know that we have to, you know, work out to compensate for that. So, I don't get the concept when somebody says, oh, I'm never hungry. I, I, the food, I could kill us about food. I'm like, hello, who are you? But anyway, hey, that I guess that's a good problem or a bad problem. I don't know. But um, I don't think I've ever had that problem. Anyway, you guys, okay, I'm going to get ready to cook. Please join me in my next video. I love you guys so much, and itchy nose. 
means somebody's talking about me. It's probably you. No. Anyway. Hey, you guys have a great Easter. If you already had it, see this afterwards. Hope you had a great Easter. I can't believe it's already here. Um, it's like the date. Some months are going so, so fast. Before we know it, it's going to be Memorial Day weekend and then summer. But anyway, you guys, hey, be be uh, kind. Be careful this weekend. Uh, there will be probably a lot of people on the road. And uh, be safe because there's only one of you. There's only one of me. So we got to take care of us. I love you guys all. Bye now.